Hey folks, Matt Easton here. So I get told a lot on a lot of my videos that I should be using the metric system instead of the imperial system. And I kind of think, F you. No, I don't think that. I kind of think, well, should I? Is that correct? Um, and then, you know, the problem is that I grew up with the imperial system primarily. So essentially really small things I measure in millimeters and centimeters and bigger things I measure in inches and feet and yards and, um, <laughs> and miles indeed. Uh, and you know, when I'm talking about shooting ranges, for example, I might talk about a thousand yards. I know that that's approximately a thousand meters, kind of. Um, obviously, they diverge a bit the bigger the numbers you get, but you know, five meters is about five yards, I think. But you know, I think in yards, and we shoot in yards, and you know, so I thought, right, I'll go and look at my analytics, maybe this will solve the thing. So I go and look at it, and I find that basically over 50% of my viewers and my watch time is the United States and the United Kingdom. So therefore, the majority of people watching my videos or spending time watching my videos use the imperial system. <laughs> That's not to say we use the imperial system for everything. As mentioned, like me, we use the metric for some stuff. But by and large, if we look at the number of views only, you can see that 52% of my views are from the United States and the United Kingdom. And we both shoot in yards. We talk about 1,000 yards or 30 yards or 80 yards or whatever. So I feel justified in using yards for the majority of the viewers. But for the rest of you out there, we're looking at the analytics highlighted a couple of things which were quite surprising to me. Uh, I suppose it makes sense, you know, I'm an English speaking person with an English speaking channel. It makes sense that a lot of the places where they speak the most English uh, or where English is most, pre most prevalent are going to watch the channel more, understandably. Um, but there's a few surprises in there. For example, Germany is the third greatest number of views after the USA and the United Kingdom. Well, that makes some degree of sense when you think about the population of Germany. So Germany is the most populous country in Europe, in Western Europe anyway. And um, so it makes, it makes some degree of sense that there's lots of German viewers, but also if you think about the demographic, there's lots of uh, HEMA people and reenactors and this kind of stuff, shooters in Germany. Uh, but additionally, lots of Germans these days, certainly below a certain age, a lot of Germans speak English. Um, and next up, we've got Canada and Australia, Sweden, Netherlands, Finland, all places where there's lots of English speakers. But hold on for a second, rewind that. Think about the number of views and then think about it relative to population. So it makes absolute sense that the USA would be the greatest number of views, not only because they're English speaking, but because they're incredibly numerous. The USA is a really big country. What's it, about 300 million people? The United Kingdom is relatively small, so actually in some senses we, we might not work, what, we're about 65 million, something like that I think. So you wouldn't perhaps expect them to be as high as they are, but of course it's a British speaking person, it's a British channel, so you probably expect lots of British viewers. Additionally, um, the HEMA community is very big in the United Kingdom, so that may play a part as well. There's lots of reenactors, lots of HEMA people, lots of uh, people doing the sort of things that I talk about. Canada and Australia, we can see some degree of sense there. They're fairly populous countries and English speaking, but Sweden, Sweden, is, yeah, okay, there's lots of people speaking English there, but Sweden has a population of just under 10 million people. It's mind boggling that they are one, two, three, four, five, sixth, their sixth greatest number of views on my list with only not even 10 million people. That is mind boggling. So I have to say a special thank you to all of the Swedish viewers. You are batting well above uh, average there. You're punching well above your weight. But I think in relative terms, even more, Finland, Finland, how is Finland at eighth when Finland only has five and a half million people? How are so many people in Finland watching my videos? Or maybe it's just a small number of people watching my videos over and over again. But Finland, you are amazing. So hats off. Uh, bows, curtsies and everything to Finland because with a mere five and a half million people you are in eighth greatest number of views on my channel. So there we go from an imperial and metric system through to thanking Sweden and especially Finland for your views. Thanks for watching. Cheers folks. Ah but one other thing I forgot. France! 
France, you make me sad. I love France as a country. It's got so much going for it. I've spent lots of time in France and you're way down there. You've got a population as big as the UK and yet you're way down the list. You're below you're below Sweden, Finland and Norway. What's going on, France? I want you to pull your socks up. Do better. Thanks for watching. We've got extra videos on Patreon. Please give our Facebook a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Cheers, folks.